Hello friends, um, friends this is the problem from our no paper pen series. You can also be part of this and uh, this way you will be able to learn good number of new concepts. Right, uh, every day you will be learning something new concepts, some new concepts. You just can join us on Facebook to be a part of this group. Okay, so let's take this problem. Problem is from time, speed and distance and your basics must be clear before you come for this uh, uh, session. I uh, can say and uh, here we will not be using paper and pen to solve the problems right we just have to do the mental exercise right uh, mental exercise okay so in this case a train can travel 50 percent faster than a car both start from uh, point a at the same time and reach point b 75 kilometers away from a at the same time on the way however the train lost about 12.5 minutes while stopping on the stations what is the speed of the car now speed of the car is less than the speed of the train right and uh, speed of the train is actually 50 percent more than a car right now if we assume the speed of the car to be unit say one right then the speed of the train will be 50% more than that that is 3 by 2 right so if speed is 3 by 2 time of train the or we can say the time the time uh, that uh, will be taken by this train will be 2 by 3 than that of the car that means if speed is 3 by 2 time will be 2 by 3 right so from unit it will be one third less okay speed is 3 by 2 time will be 2 by 3 so it is one third less from unit now according to this statement it is losing 12.5 minutes right so basically it uh, that uh, it means uh, the train takes 12.5 minutes less than car to cover up this distance of 75 kilometer and in other ways I am uh, telling you it is taking one third less time than this car and th that means this one third is nothing but 12.5 right if one third is 12.5 that means one will be 12.5 into 3 that is 37.5 minutes so 37.5 minute is the time the unit time is taken by car so 37.5 minute is the time that is taken by car to travel this distance that is 75 kilometer right 37.5 into 2 is 75 that means the speed of the car is what 2 kilometers per minute right or we can say in one hour it will run 120 kilometers so the speed of the car is 120 kilometer per hour see sometimes sir, if you have to write any data you just use your paper and pen but to be to uh, solve these sort of problems do not make equations lengthy equations will be time consuming and space consuming so the only simple funda we have used over here the speed of the train is 50 percent more that means if the speed of the car is unit it will be 3 by 2 right if the speed is 3 by 2 and speed and time the relationship is inverse so if speed is 3 by 2 time will be 2 by 3 that is one third less than car right and this one third is nothing but this 12.5 minutes right unit is the time of car unit is the speed of the car so do not get confused one third is 12.5 that means one is 37.5 and one means unit means time of car right so do not get confused so but, uh, the car will be taking 37.5 minutes to complete this distance and the train will be taking 12.5 minutes less than this that is so from 37.5 if you deduct 12.5 will be getting uh, 25 so the train uh, if it doesn't stop anywhere it will take uh, the, the speed of the train will be 25 km per hour and if it doesn't stop anywhere it will take just 30 minutes uh, I'm sorry 25 minutes to reach this uh, to cover this distance so the problem is very simple and uh, I'm sure you are clear if you are not clear for the first time though I have uh, repeated this um, you can go through the explanation once again Okay. 